Hello world, it's Chatty Dad One coming at you today. Hope everybody's well. Um, I never understood why people were uh, saying things that the, you know, the Jews were Zionist and bad and all this stuff. And then I heard about the Noahide laws, and I got to looking into this a bit, and what I found just absolutely floored me. I had no idea that uh, this stuff was going on. Um, in Congress they adopted the Noahide laws and there's not a lot of information about it on the uh, Thomas Library of Congress website. As a matter of fact the next day when I went back it, the stuff I couldn't find it at all it was like gone but uh, this is how they they put it um, they basically recognize the historical tradition of the ethical values and principles which are based on civilized society upon and upon which our great nation was founded well that's not the truth our nation was founded on you know Bible based principles what these guys are talking about is the Torah the Old Testament rabbinical laws that are the seven Noahide laws in other words like for instance um, thou shalt have no other God before me you know they're talking about if you believe in Jesus Christ then you can be beheaded okay now this is why Christians are being absolutely pummeled and attacked because of these laws the uh, Congress recognized this old rabbi who's a part of this Jewish um, sect and they called it education day even um, it says um, whereas in tribute to this great spiritual leader the raid this his 90th year will be as one of the education and giving one of education and giving um, we turn to education and charity to return the world to a moral and ethical value contained in the seven Noahide laws okay that's the only place you're going to even find this mentioned here and uh, there were some congressmen that knew what was going on and what was behind all this stuff and uh, this is whereas Rabbi Menech, Menechem Mendel Nerson, leader of the Lubavitch movement, and that is like the uh, the Orthodox Jews. Okay, these are not normal Jews. These are like the old rabbis who, you know, they can't touch a woman and you know really really old time dudes um, this is some of that okay this is this here the, um, Oprah did a thing on this whole thing now these people are out to destroy Christianity absolutely destroy it because we worship Jesus Christ they believe Jesus Christ is boiling in a tub of his own ex in hell okay um, this is from Bill Dunnemeyer he's a US congressman um, tried to bring this to everybody's attention of what was going on here that these people were setting up courts and all uh, rabbinical courts to behead Christians because we believe in Jesus Christ okay and uh, these are the laws 
these Noahide laws, you know, thou shalt not steal, thou shalt not kill. Basically, uh, the laws before Jesus came and was uh, crucified, giving the ultimate sacrifice and making the new law, which is thou shalt love the Lord thy God with all thy mind, heart, and strength, and um, love thy neighbor. And, uh, you know, he said all other commandments are hinged on these. And he was the one who did it. And God is the one who tells us, you know, he sent his only begotten son to save mankind from death and hell. So, you know, right there, they don't believe Jesus Christ was the Son of God or the Savior. They believe it was all a conspiracy, you know, made up, and all this kind of... I mean, there's a lot of weird stuff that, that I don't understand. But they are very close to the president. Um they are very close to the happenings that's going on in our government as well as the Israel government and when they talk about keeping the land of the Jews they're not talking about the little part of land that they now have I'll show you what they're talking about now this is all stuff that this congressman uh, tried to let people know um, and he was you know he was mocked pretty bad and you know they made a lot of made him look like a nut kinda but uh you know I was just I'm just shocked by all this stuff I had no idea that they were out to destroy Christianity like this and exactly what they think of those who worship Jesus Christ as the Son of God uh, okay I don't know what just happened here well 